In order to have effective Scrum, we need to facilitate four core time-boxed events really well. Let's spend some time today looking at the sprint review and some tips so you can have a very productive sprint review meeting. The first thing to remember, the sprint review is a demo of your product. It is not a smoke and mirrors PowerPoint of what it should do and should look like. Let's look at the stakeholders then. The stakeholders, the customers, and the end users. You want them to attend your sprint review meeting so they're getting the latest update on how your product is doing. If you have multiple stakeholders and customers um, who share different teams, you may want to combine the sprint review meeting so that your stakeholders have time to go to them so they're not expected to go to four different meetings every single week. Some other tips, maybe rotate the person who's doing the demo so different team members get a chance to demo the product. Try not to hold a sprint review meeting on a Monday or Friday. You'll not get very good attendance. And remember, this meeting is the perfect opportunity to give you transparency into how you're doing with your product. So bring your roadmap, bring your release plan, Bring your cumulative flow and your burn up to give transparency into how your product is going. If you want more Scrum tips, visit the Brain Trust website and you'll also find information about our upcoming classes.